In this video, we are going to talk about how you can record screen and take a screenshot in ChutuBox. In ChutuBox, you can record or capture the software screen and add watermarks to them. To do that, click the Screenshots and Records button in the menu bar. First, let's talk about screen recording. The screen recorder in ChutuBox captures your software screen for a set duration and output it as a GIF animated image. In the screen recording tool settings, you can set the duration and the frame rate. The time here is for setting the length of the whole screen recording. Here 5 means the image will be 5 seconds long. Frame rate sets the frame per second for the image. If it's higher, your image will be smoother, but it will occupy more space. Then you can click the start button or press the control and F1 keys on your keyboard to start the recording. Here we do some simple editing for the models. When the time is up, you can save this GIF to the location you want. Then you can open that folder to view the recording. Next, let's talk about how to take a screenshot. Click the capture option and click start or on your keyboard. Press the Ctrl, Shift and A keys to start screenshot. At the beginning, the software will give you a default capture area. You can click to take a screenshot of that area. But if you don't like it, click and drag your mouse to select a new area. You can also adjust the size and position of the selected area. After the area is confirmed, you can move on to edit your captures. You can add straight lines, draw on the image, add squares, circles, arrows, and texts. You can also change the sizes and colors of these items. Then, if you click the check button, it will save the screenshot to the clipboard. You can paste it to a third-party image editor to do further editing or saving. If you click the cancel button, it will exit the screenshot without saving. If you click the save button, you can choose a right place to save this screenshot. Finally, let's talk about watermarks. Screenshots and recordings in ChutuBox have watermarks added by default. To do that, click the watermark option. There are three rows in the watermark settings you can edit. Date, author, and other remarks. You can decide whether to show or hide any of these rows and how to edit their contents. Once you finish editing, next time you do a screenshot or recording, you will see how your edited watermarks look like.